Tip Benson here. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be talking about Ralph Lauren's Tender Romance. So if you want to hear my thoughts on it, make sure you keep watching. So this fragrance was given to me by the Fragrance Foundation. It's actually a part of their 2017 Consumer's Choice Award. So make sure that you vote and check out their website at fragrance.org and let's get into the review. When I first smelled this fragrance, I knew that I would, I knew that I was gonna fall in love with it. This has all the notes that I really, really love. So let's get into a note breakdown. So if I had to describe this in three words, I would say it is fruity, musky, sensual. I can go on and on about what this fragrance does and I'm actually very surprised that I like it. I generally do not reach for designer mainstream type perfumes especially Ralph Lauren no shade Ralph I love you I love your clothes but I would not normally gravitate towards scents from Ralph Lauren just being honest this is a fruity floral spicy oriental fragrance it is so beautifully done I like that it has the pear note in there, the bergamot. It's really beautiful, the opening of this one. So as far as uniqueness, has something like this been done before? Yes, it has, but don't let that deter you from giving this one a try. You would probably like this if you are a fan of deeper, richer scents, spicy oriental type fragrances. Again, this is a little lighter. This it's a little sheer, which is why I feel like I can wear this through the summer and spring. I look forward to wearing this in the summer and spring for sure. I think it's full bottle worthy and I would definitely welcome this into my collection. Versatility. This is like, you know, you got your makeup on, you've got your hair done. This is definitely a going out scent. I feel like guys will really, really like this one. Um, something about the musk and the benzoin. Benzoin is like one of my favorite notes. It just kind of smells um, caramelized on the skin. Um, going out, casual. I mean, I sprayed it on me and I have on like a bodysuit and sweat. So this is definitely one of those fragrances that I would wear if I need like a little pick me up and shushing. Compliments, I mean, if I were to smell you wearing this, I would definitely give you a compliment. Like, girl, you smell amazing. So projection, the fragrance projects. This is something that will hover around you. Probably distance wise, I would say maybe about a foot out. Um, however, if you're walking past someone, I'm sure they would smell it on you because I could just I could smell the power of this one. The fruity top notes are definitely in the air and hover around you. As far as longevity, I feel like this will probably last about six to seven hours. And I already know myself, like even though this does last quite a, a long time, I would probably respray this one just because I'm in love with the opening of this. And since it starts to kind of draw closer to the skin at the three to four hour mark, I would just respray. So the price of this fragrance is $76. It's kind of up there. I think it's worth it. I do think it's worth it. It's special enough and it smells nice enough that I think it's worth that price tag. The packaging. The packaging is fairly minimal. It's nothing over the top. It's very standard for Ralph Lauren. It's a cute little white top, a, 
the box is pink, no frills, you know, pink outlined in silver. This juice inside is all that matters anyway. So I'm just gonna spray myself one last time before I finish this video because I really am enjoying this. And once again, thank you to the Fragrance Foundation for gifting this fragrance to me. Make sure to visit me at tiffvinson.com for more details on this fragrance. And also give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if this is your first time here and I'll catch you in the next video. Bye.